right, we still got about five minutes. Still got about five minutes before the epic banana Tabata cardio strength comes together and blows your mind. That's happening today. Two minutes, two minutes, countdown is on. About to get started. I hope you're ready today to get strong. It is gonna be a good one. It's gonna be a good one. I just hope I make it all the way through. I'm uh, coming in a little bit sore today, but <clears throat> I'm gonna show up for you. I just need to make sure you all give me 100% today. That's all I need. You give me 100%. I'll make it through. All right, if you got any weights, make sure you get some weights, some dumbbells, dumbbells or kettlebells, make either one work, and a uh, little bit of space. You got a towel, get a towel. You're gonna be sweaty today. You're gonna be sweaty. Where's my little? There we go. <coughs> okay. All right. What's up, Naomi? What's up, Sydney? Let's get after it this morning, huh? Get this workout in and get outside. Enjoy some sunshine. Six feet away from somebody, but you know, you still enjoy some sunshine. Can I just hang out right here? Look at that. Warm up, huh? Gonna go nice and easy. 
Remember, if you're just tuning in, grab some weights. We're going to need some dumbbells uh, or some kettlebells. But let's start off with just a nice, easy jogging in place. Shake those arms out a little bit. Just moving nice and easy. And then grow slowly, start to get your knees up just a little bit. So we're jogging in place. Knees are coming up a little bit more. And then they're getting up a little bit higher here for another five seconds. <clears throat> All right, and then bring them back down to just <clears throat> barely moving off the floor. And we're going to go into some jumping jacks. Nice big arms. Hop the feet apart, nice soft landing. Remember, you always got your option here to step to the side. Not mad at that. And then we're pushing in the front. Still hopping. Or stepping either way. Really bring those elbows back. Gets the back warmed up as well as pushing forward. Great. I'm honestly, I'm tired already. <laughs> I did, uh, I did a nice little <clears throat> personal challenge over the weekend where <clears throat> I ran four miles every four hours for 48 hours nonstop. <clears throat> and the very last one, of course, I had an extra mile. So I ended up doing 49 miles from 8 p.m. Friday night till like 4.40 on Sunday afternoon. So my legs are a little heavy today. We're going back into jogging in place. But that just means for you, Get those heels up. No excuses. Zero excuses out of you today. I want you working hard. I want you powering through even if I take a break. Heels up. Three, two, one. Good. Let's get into some seal jacks. <clears throat> Open those arms up. If this bothers your shoulder, don't go too far back. Just nice and easy with it. Three, two, one. Good. Let's get inside of the foot touches next. You can get a little hop going. If you don't have the rhythm to it, just step in and get it. But if you can add that little hop, you get it a little quicker. Great. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. And one thing, quick thing about mindset. I knew I had to do this workout today, right? I knew I was going to be, I'm still sore. I knew I was going to be tired. But my mindset was like, if I'm going to have to do this workout, number one, I'm going to switch it to I get to do this workout. Like, I'm physically able there's people actually going to watch, which is awesome. So why not make it just absolutely bananas crazy hard, right? Like, if I'm going to do it, like, let's do it right. So that's why I just want you to have that mindset. If you're going to do it, do it right. My dad used to tell me that all the time when I would do my math homework. And it never stuck because I always had to redo it a million times because I sucked at it and I still do. But the concept stuck in my head was that if you're going to do it, do it right. And that's what I want you to adopt today when we're doing this workout. Do it right. We're not done on the warm up yet. We're gonna pop down for some mountain climbers. Hands out of the shoulders, backs flat. Bring those knees in. Halfway. Good. And then let's get a couple squats in, shall we? Shoulders and chest up. Sit on down into those squats. Woo! Two, nice. Knees back behind the toes. Four. Five, good work. Six, seven, eight, couple left. Niner, and 10, good. We're gonna go hands up high in the air. Make yourself long. Reach down, a little stretch in the hammies. And walk your hands out. Get a push up in. Walk your hands back to your feet. Reach back to the sky. Walk them out. Push up. Reach up to the sky, and a third, good. All right, we got a couple lunges coming your way. Down into the lunge, twist it, and alternate. Lunge it, twist it, very good. Alternate here, nice and easy, gradually getting that back knee a little lower each time. Couple left, and switch it. All right, shake those legs out. We're gonna go <clears throat> high knees nice and quick for five, quick feet for five, 
heels up for five, and then five quick jumping jacks, okay? So three, two, one, high knees, five, four, three, two, one. Get the heels up, five, four, three, two, one. I'm gonna go quick feet for five, five, four, three, two, one, and then we got our jumping jacks. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, you should feel warm, a little out of breath, heart rate up, knee into the shoulder here. Very good. Pull that across the body next. Very good. Get it back behind you. Other side, knee in. Knee across. Back behind you. Get that heel down, reach for the toe. Make sure you get both sides. Get a little crouch. Press the knees out. Mm, yes. Let's get this calves today too, because we do got some jumps and hops coming your way. So my favorite calf stretch is here. Cross one foot over. You can even do this one standing up a little bit. Oh, I never personally get that good of a stretch standing. All right, you guys feel ready? Here's what we got on the agenda. So Tabata Tuesday, so it's gonna be Tabata style where we work for 20, we rest for 10, okay? So first step, cardio, mountain climbers, 20 on, 10 rest. Then we're gonna go into V-ups, 20 on, 10 rest. Up we go for star jumps, then we've got lateral hops, and then we've got squat jumps. We're gonna work our way through that. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, four times, then you're done with it, okay? Then you're done with it, then we move on. Then once we've made it all the way through the cardio version, we pop over to the strength. That's where we will use your dumbbells or your kettlebells, and I'll walk you through those as we're there, okay? So if you're not ready, get ready, because it's about to go down. I'm certainly not ready, but I'm gonna do it anyway. So we're starting off down on the floor, push up position, mountain climbers. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. Like I said, four times, okay? And then once we're done with the four, you're done, it's crossed off your list. So here we go, let's get to work. Down we go, ready, three, two, one, and go. Mountain climbers, hands stay under the shoulders. Keep your back flat. You're already 10 down. Look at that. <clears throat> Five more seconds. Two and rest. Good. One down. <clears throat> ah, this is gonna be easy, right? Yeah, maybe not. All right, number two. Ready, go. Got 10 more seconds. Five more seconds. Two, and done, good work. Two down, two to go. Keep those shoulders loose. Ready, round number three, and begin. Bring those knees in, bring those knees in, come on. Keep your back flat. Just hold this high plank if you need to rest. We're on our home stretch. Five seconds. Two. Done. Good job. All right. Last one coming up. Three down, one to go. Here we go. Last one. And finish strong. Last set, best set. <clears throat> Very good, very good. <clears throat> 10 more seconds. Five seconds, come on. 
And done. Woo! Good job. One down. Cross it off. We got V-ups next. You know what? Quick change. No, that's not true. We'll stick with it. V-ups. Down we go. <clears throat> Have a seat. So, you got a V-up where your legs stay straight or an ab row where your knee comes in. Whatever feels best. The V-ups feel too hard. Or they strain your back. Or you just don't like them. Switch to the, the ab rows. Either way, no problem, okay? Or every other. So here we go. 20 seconds on the clock. Three, two, and go. Like, there's no way I'll do four sets of these. Ten more seconds. A little bend in the knees, okay? Almost there. All right, rest. One down, maybe. Mine's are kind of, mine's like a combo. Okay, number two. Go. You need an extra challenge, you take your hands off the floor too. That's advanced level seven ninja abs. Whew. 10 seconds, keep going. And done, good. Woo, two down, two down, two to go, halfway. Nice job. Five seconds to go. Ready, go. Just hold the boat. If you need a little rest to work the abs, that's too fine. 10 seconds left. Oh, rest it. Ah. Last one coming up. Last one coming up. Come on, finish strong. It's the last time doing it for the day. Make it count. Let's go. Ten more seconds. Five more seconds. Yeah. Yeah. Last one. Oh. Oh. Nice job. Woo. Nice job. Two down. Lots to go. Oh man, yeah. Sam's ready. People are taking a sneak peek for later. Whew. Okay, star jump time. <clears throat> now remember, two versions on your star jumps. You start with your feet together, you hop apart in the air, and it all comes back together. Option two, you have one foot staying on the floor, okay? Whatever works best for you. You do you, just make sure you're getting challenged. Okay, three, two, and go. Nice soft landing. Even if you're on the second floor, they shouldn't hear you down there. Good, round one done. Okay, number two, and go. Ten seconds left. Five seconds. Ten. Two down, halfway. Two to go. Here we go, ready, and go. Ten seconds left. Good, done. Woo! Last one coming. <clears throat> Last one coming. Make it a good one, make it a good one, come on. Three, two, one, go. Ten 
10 more seconds, come on. Five seconds. And done. Woo! Nice job. Okay. All right, we got climbers done, knee ups, star jumps. Awesome stuff. <clears throat> so, next up. Lateral hops, feet together, and back and forth. So don't make them just like this, it's too easy. Get some distance, right? Feet across, stick that landing, soft knees, big jump back, nice and soft, okay? We'll work for 20 seconds, make sure you don't land on anything, and we'll rest, we'll get it going for four rounds. Three, two, one, go. I think I can go straight on. Yeah, you don't mind. And rest. One down. Nice. I like those. I like those. Boop. Number two. Coming at you. Ready and go. Step to the side if you're not jumping. Ten more seconds. Five seconds. And done. Oh. One left, one left. Okay, ready? Go. this round. One left. We got our squat jumps. Now remember, your squat jumps, it's down, nice big land, jump, soft landing, easy. Switch to squats if you need to. And then if your legs are burning out of control, keep going. But if you feel like you're hurt yourself, you hold the squat hold, okay? All right, let's make this last one the best one, right? Last one, the best one. Here we go, 20 seconds on the clock. Three, two, one. Squat jumps. Halfway. Good form. Rest. Wow. Wow, what did I tell you? <laughs> I'm gonna tell you that's tough, that's tough. Ready, go! Keep those knees back behind the toes. Don't let your knees come forward. Sit into it. 10 seconds, go. Get them, come on. Bust them out, five seconds. Rest, two down, two to go. My legs. Yes. I'm feeling it. Here we go. Number three. Go. Ten more seconds. One more. Ah, nice. 
nice. All right, three down, one left. Oh, 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 my form doesn't look great. Extra emphasis when you're tired. Sometimes you gotta slow down and really focus on your form. Ready? Go. Ten seconds. time. <laughs> oh. Okay. All right. Grab yourself a drink. <clears throat> Towel off. Run to the corner and back. Go hit the hill. Go do a set of stairs in your house. <laughs> Thirty seconds. Catch your breath. We're moving on to some strength. Moving on to some strength work. First one with the weights. We've got a bicep curl, overhead press. Key on this one, most important part, is your elbows should really be tucked into your body, so our curl is using the our bicep muscles. And then also, you don't want to really rock with it and bend it all over the place. Keep your back nice and flat. Come to neutral. Curl. And then if you need just the slightest bend in the knee to power up over your head, you can do that. Feel like your shoulders are working, okay? You guys are doing awesome. Really proud of you so far. Big John? Big John in the house? Let's go, Big John. All right, rest time is over. Cardio is done for the day, done and dusted, nicely done. Now let's get that strength on. Let's build those muscles. Let's get strong. Let's get strong. Okay. You guys ready? Grabbing the weights. Again, it's still gonna be Tabata style. So you're gonna bust your butt for 20 seconds, rep it out, rest for 10, and then we're back into it. We're going four times, okay? So here we go. First set coming at you. Three, two, one, and let's get to work. Curl, boom, press them out. If you got lighter weights like I do, you're going for a few extra reps. If you got some heavier weights, then you might slow down a little bit to make sure your form technique is dialed. Good, rest, one down already. Just like that, just like that. Here we go, next one, two, one. Let's get strong, uh, come on. Yeah, buddy. Come on. Ten seconds left. I want you to feel that burn. I want you to look for that burn. Lean into the burn and keep it going. Rest it. Two down, two to go. Two down, two to go. All right. Number three. Ready and get some. Remember, keep those elbows tucked in. Curl it up. Elbows tucked. Press. Shouldn't be rocking. Shouldn't be rocking. Should be nice and steady. Two more. And rest. Nice. Three down, one left. All right, last set. Make it your best one. stretch here guys come on finish it off with me uh, nice all right bam one down on the strength front one down on the strength front it feel good it feels good to check them off it feels good to check I'm gonna check off this just cardio too it feels good to check them off as I go so if you got a kettlebell now's the time because we got swings I'm going to do mine with the dumbbells, so you can hold them together if you want to use both to make it a little bit heavier, or you might just hold one, right? Now remember on our kettlebell swings, feet are about shoulder length apart, a little bit of a bend in my knees, but not much. We're not squatting, friends. Just a little bend. I'm going to hip hinge it, 
my back is flat, I'm sticking my butt back, and I'm holding my weight, whether it's a kettlebell or a dumbbell, like I'm about to hike it, right? And then I stand and swing. Drive my hips. I really want to squeeze the glutes, okay? That's the main key. That's what's going to protect your lower back. So here we go. We've got 20 times four coming your way. And begin. Squeeze those glutes. Drive those hips. Remember, just a little bend in the knee. Ten to go. Nothing like kettlebell swings to combine the cardio and strength to rest. Good job. Okay, number two. <clears throat> Ready? And rock it. Good job. Ten more seconds. Done, good. Halfway, halfway. Two down, two to go. Ready, three, two, and rock it. Rock it. Ten to go. Five seconds. Last set, sorry. I told you I was about math. Ready, go. Last set. Finish strong. Ten seconds. Squeeze those glutes. Drive those hips. Five seconds. And done. Nice work. Woo! Set those down. Get those forearms. Chance to rest. Nice work. Woo! All right, so if you switch to dumbbells, I'm sorry, if you switch to kettlebells, hold on to your kettlebell, because we're gonna do some rows. We're gonna do some row, great rows. We're gonna do some rows with the kettlebell next if you got it. If you don't, don't sweat. We can use the dumbbells too, okay? So I'm going to use the dumbbells for my rows. Again, you can use your kettlebell. If you have a kettlebell, it's going to look more like this with your rows. If your kettlebell is super heavy and your shoulders are back and get tired, add a little knee bend in there to give you a little momentum. Otherwise, I'm using my dumbbells and I'm getting them in like this, okay? So here we go, 20 on the clock. And go. Same idea. Try to come to a standstill with your arms and then start fresh. 10 down, 10 to go. Five seconds left. Good, rest it out. One down, three left. Ready, next one, three, two, and go. Nice job. 10 more seconds. Get those elbows up. Your elbows should be higher than your wrists, not vice versa. You don't want your wrists higher than your elbows. Good, rest. Two down, two left. Ready, three, two, and rock it. Number three, we're on the home stretch of the whole workout, guys. Look at that. There is a secret bonus coming though after this strength Tabata. Gotta tell you, it's gonna suck, but it's gonna be awesome. Five seconds. Ah. Ah. Rest. Good job. Woo -woo -woo. Ah. Okay, last set of rows. Last set of rows. And go. seconds. 
three seconds. Ah, done. Woo! Nice work. Nice. Cross that one off also. Rose under. There's another kind of row on there. This next one, we're going to return to the dumbbells, or you can do one kettlebell at a time, but we're going to be bent over at the hips, chest closer to the floor, arms out, and we're going to row it up here. I really want these elbows close to your body, okay? Close to your body. My back is flat, it's not rounded, okay? And I'm not up here. I'm trying to get my chest down, I'm bending at the waist, rowing those up, okay? Really trying to isolate some, some key muscles here. Oh, whoa, what? Jacqueline, Jill, Harry, welcome. Welcome to the gun show. Welcome to the workout. You guys are coming in a little bit late, but that's okay. I'm not mad at that. You're always welcome to jump in. You may have missed my disclaimer earlier that I ran a crap ton of miles, so I'm moving a little slower today, but I'm doing the best I can. So here we go, upright row time. Remember, bending at the hips, back flat, row those guys up. If you're kettlebelling it, you're probably going one arm at a time, and you can switch every 20 seconds, right? Keep that lower back tucked in. Couple to go. Three, two, good. Rest, one down. I'll get a message. Ready, next one. Three, two, bend it at the hips. Back's flat, row it up. Ten seconds to go. Right. Two down, two to go. We're so close. We're so close. I can smell the finish line. It smells like a warm shower. Here we go, next one. Woo! Don't stop now, come on. These are the results coming. Strong back, strong arms. Core is working in this exercise. You're doing it right. 10 more seconds. Rest, nice. One more of these, one more. Ready, last one, best one, and get to work. Keep those elbows up. seconds to go. Two, one. Nice. Woo! Let's go. Nice job. We're almost there. We're almost there. Oh man, it feels good to cross those off as we go. So last one's going to be that deadlift. Last one's going to be the deadlift. You get to use either your dumbbells or your kettlebells. I would say use whatever's heavier. <clears throat> use whatever you got that's heavier. And it's a similar motion from our kettlebell swing and our bent over rows. We're holding the weight. I'm bending just a little bit of a bend in the knee. The, coming from, the bend is coming from my hips. Hip hinge. I reach down, come back up, squeeze those glutes, okay? So 20 seconds, four times. And then we got our top secret killer bonus and then we'll be done, okay? So here we go. Then the time, let's go. Just a little bend in the knee, squeeze those glutes. You should really feel in the hamstrings and your glutes as you're squeezing, coming up. Nice, squeeze one more in. Rest. Nice job. Second round coming. And two, one, go. Nice job. 10 seconds to go. Good, rest it out. Two down, two left. Bonus curl. That was for you, champions do more. Bonus curl one more time. Whew, all right, my legs are heavy. Next one, and get it. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Nice 
Nice job. 10 more seconds. One more, get one more in there. Nicely done, all right. One left, friends, one left. Bonus bicep curls for you. Last set of deadlifts, three, two, and get some. Nice, 10 more seconds. Five seconds. And done, nice. I'm proud of you. I want you to be proud of yourself. That's good work. That's cardio. That's strength. That's bringing them together. Close friends. Now, here's what we're going to do to finish. We're going to do, oh, let me cross that off for us. Let me cross that off. Most important part. Bam! Okay, so the top secret bonus, push-ups. Now, the way we're gonna get after these push-ups is it's gonna be a Tabata style, but it's gonna be the real, original version of the Tabata, which means 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, not four, not six, but eight times, okay? 20 on, 10 off, eight times of the work. So, what that means is you may need to switch to the knees for the push-ups. You may need to hold the plank for the push-ups. No problem. I want you to do your version, but I want you to do the very best version that you can do, okay? Don't half-ass it. We didn't go this far on the workout just to cut out early or to not get them all the way. So go 110% on this last bit. If your shoulder's hurting you, oh, I just can't do anymore, hold that plank or hold the plank from the elbows, okay? So 20 seconds on the clock for our first set of exercises. Get your weights out of the way. If you need a mat for your knees, no problem. 20 seconds and go. Just keep your elbows in on your push ups. Don't let your butt get too high. 10 down already. Good, rest. There's one. And here we go for two. Five more seconds. All right, there's two. You're doing great. Come on, we got this. Remember, use the plank if you need it. Here comes three, and go. Ten more seconds. All right, three down. This next one puts us halfway. You got this. Ready? Two, one, go. Ten seconds left. Come on, five seconds. All right, four down, four to go, four to go. Ready? Three, two, and here comes number five. Keep those elbows in. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Done. Good job. Five down. Here comes number six. Here comes number six. Let's go. Ready? Get it. Oh. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds. Nice job. Six down. Come on, two more. Two more. Here comes number seven. Ready? 
Ten seconds. Rest. All right, last one coming up. Last one coming up. Ready and go. Last 20 seconds, come on guys. 10 seconds. One more, last one. Last one. That's it. That's it. Nice job. Oh man. Oh man. What y'all saying? All right, give me one of these, please. Pull that arm across. Oh, oh. Same thing, other side. Ah, give me some of these. Those shoulders, those shoulders, up and down. Nice, easy circles. Backwards. Nicely done, nicely done. Grab a foot. Good, excuse me. Same thing on the other side. Lean it across. Reaching down, hamstring. Hey, great job today. That was a tough one for me. Hope you felt challenged. Thank you so much for participating. I really, really appreciate you. Thanks for giving your best. When you give your best, it makes everybody else better. So that's awesome. And uh, make sure you leave me a comment if you like the workout. So I got some good feedback. And if you haven't heard, we've released the Kid Fitness program. And if you want more information, just leave me a comment. Say I want more information and I'll, I'll send you the info. Thanks so much. Have a great day. Get outside if you can. Get some sunshine. It's going to be good for you. And uh, hopefully I'll see you soon. Bye.